Is she wearing a necklace? Is she naturally sparkly? I, I don't know. and welcome back to my channel so recently I went shopping and I got quite a few things but I realized that a lot of these things would make excellent gifts some of them may be obvious but some of them might be quite unusual at least to me I've never really seen some of these things being gifted before but I would personally love all of these things as a gift I do have about 15 items here give or take all of these things vary in price range I have some things that can be used as stocking stuffers, very affordable, and then I do have some things going into the hundreds that are much more substantial gifts. Um, so I do have a pretty big variety here, and uh, this will be a great gift guide in case you are absolutely stumped on what to get your loved one. But before we begin, let me remind you that subscribing is 100% free, so please click that subscribe button. And while you're at it, go ahead and click that notification bell so that you're notified every time that I post. I post every single week, every single week, and sometimes multiple times a week, so trust me, you don't wanna miss out. Alrighty, so let's jump straight into it. Let's just start off with this item right here. My husband actually picked this up from Home Goods, and it is $7.99, and it is this little glass shaker, you know, for alcoholic beverages, and yes, this is more for adults, of course, but um, I mean, I don't know. Maybe you can shake some really amazing chocolate milk in here. I love chocolate milk. But this shaker is really cool because it actually has recipes for very popular drinks on the side here. Um, let's see, recipes include Old Fashioned, Negroni, Moscow Mule, Margarita, Mint Julep, Mojito, and Martini. So uh, it even has like a little measuring thing here. Um, I'm not really a drinker, but uh, this will be great, especially for beginners, um, because I mean, it has everything that you need right here on the glass itself. And I love this frosted glass, it's so gorgeous. The brand is Cambridge, I believe, and it's a 16 ounce recipe shaker. This would be great to add into like a gift basket, you know, if they have like a favorite drink, especially if one of their favorite drinks is this, like one of these right here. This would be great. So I thought this was really unique and I've never seen anything like this. I'm sure if you go to cambridgesilversmiths.com, you'll be able to find it. As always, I will list the items in the description box. If I forget, please just let me know in the comment section and I will give you the link. So yes, this is the first item. The next item is also from Home Goods, and this was $16.99, and it is this little s'mores mug set. I have been wanting this for so long. You have no idea. I've had this on my wish list on Amazon forever, but the price just keeps going up. It comes with four of those mugs, and it comes with hot chocolate mix. I mean, how amazing is that? These are the cutest mugs. Honestly, I love these. I mean, look at their faces. Is that not the cutest? Sorry about my ring light. So I did open it for you guys just to show you. Look how cute. It does say on the bottom, not suitable for dishwasher or microwave use. So just keep that in mind. But I don't think I would actually use these for hot cocoa. I would definitely use these for tiered trays. Have you seen those little s'mores? tiered trays oh my gosh those are so cute which is why i had been wanting these for so long honestly could you imagine getting this as a christmas gift this is so cute this is perfect for someone that you have no idea about if you just like don't know them i would go with this <laughs> this is so cute okay so i recently got some new purses which is very very exciting i mean i know i recently got lounge fly purses or backpacks but um these are more grown up items you know grown up purses and they're actually both from kate spade so let me show you the first one this is my first kate spade purse absolutely gorgeous i did also get a matching card holder which was really cool and let's see oh let's take the stuffing out shall we oh there's a lot of stuffing oh wow this is what the inside looks like. Oh, this is like a protective uh, sticker thing. Oh, that's so satisfying. 
It has a, like a little side pocket here as well, which is really easy to like put your phone in or whatever. Um, but I love this. It has uh, a little crossbody strap. And those are my favorite types of bags, crossbodies, super easy to wear. But the thing I love most about this is the hardware. It's like a very, very light gold, almost silver. In some lights, it looks silver. Some lights, it looks more gold. And I just love that because sometimes, I mean, I don't know if I'm going to wear silver jewelry, if I'm going to wear gold jewelry. I wear both all the time. So this is perfect for someone like me. I absolutely love this. And I love the little three block color thing right here. They did have like a gray version where this was gray. Like I said, I did get a matching little card holder, which I've never had a card holder before, which is really exciting. Um, it has slots on both sides like this, and it says Kate Spade. And I mean, it matches perfectly, obviously, look at that. So depending on your budget, if you can't afford a purse, you can always get a little card holder. I mean, these are so cute yet so useful. The second purse that I got is also from Kate Spade and it is this one. There's this little thing right here that you turn to open it. And oh my gosh, I love, love, love this. Yeah, it still has all my like masks and stuff in here, but it does have like um, one little zip pocket and the lining you can see and it does have a side pocket here as well let me try and show you close that is the lining and this again has that same hardware for people who are um, indecisive on what hardware to get just just go with Kate Spade and I love this chain because you can either wear it like this or you can wear like a full-on crossbody like that. Oh, you can adjust the other one too. I did not see that until now. It's like a little belt and there are notches all the way up till here. So you can make it quite a bit shorter. So that's pretty cool. So I am super excited about those two purchases. So pretty. And I don't know, I just feel like they would work for all ages. They look very sophisticated and um, just very classy and I love it. The next item on my list is by Majuri and it is a jewelry store. Um, I actually got it online. I think they're based in Canada. I'm actually wearing my Majuri pieces right here. And they are so delicate and dainty. I love these. Oh my gosh, I forgot what it's called, but it's like the single solitaire diamond. Um, I got the gold one and the silver one. Uh, I think this is actually a white gold and this is yellow gold. And I love wearing them alone. And I love wearing them like stacked together. I think it's just so pretty, especially when it's just like lays delicately, like right on your skin. These pieces are so delicate. The diamonds kind of look like they're floating on air when they're just like bare on your chest because they, like the chain of it is so very thin and delicate. You can only really see like the diamond. And like when you move in the light, it catches the light just perfectly. And there's like a little sparkle right there. And it's like, oh, is she wearing a necklace? Is she naturally sparkly? Uh, I don't know. And I just love it. I did wear it with a high neck just so you can see it better. But I uh, absolutely love these. These have become my favorite necklaces to wear. They just go with everything. They have the option for real gold and also the option for Vermeer gold i think is what it's called the vermeer gold is not real gold i think it's just like gold plated or something so it's far more um affordable but it will rust so just keep that in mind but you know you can depending on your your price range you can get whatever you like and i mean they have so many other things um, I'm already looking at a few other things that I want from them because it's I love dainty jewelry. Go to Missouri.com. I know you've probably seen a lot of YouTubers talk about Missouri. I'm not sponsored at all. I wish, I wish I was sponsored by them, but no, no, no such luck for me. But uh, yeah, I decided to give them a shot and I love my pieces. Moving on. So I did get a new Starbucks cup. I mean... How gorgeous is this? This is the rose gold one. I love how it sparkles. It's so pretty. This would make such a great gift, especially if like on the inside, you put some goodies, like some chocolate or a Starbucks gift card, something like that, you know? Um, especially if it's for like someone in your office, 
you know? A coworker, a teacher, a student. I mean, the list goes on. This would be so great. This can be a stocking stuffer if you really want it to be. But, I mean, this alone, I mean, this was what? Yeah, this was 1995. This alone would be a great gift because this is very expensive for a cup, but still so, so beautiful and uh, very hard to find. So if they are a Starbucks lover, I would go ahead and grab them a Starbucks cup. So going back to jewelry, I would suggest getting something of your loved one's birthstone. I would love to get something of my birthstone. I, I mean, I recently just got one, finally, after so many years. Um, my birthstone is aquamarine uh, for March. All the March babies know. And I did get this little stackable aquamarine ring. There's so many different shades of aquamarine. Um, this one is very, 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 very light blue, but it's there. I don't know if you can see it. Let me show you a little close up. But it is absolutely gorgeous. I love, again, very dainty um, items like this. And, you know, birthstones are supposed to bring you good luck if you wear your own birthstone. And there are so many price ranges, you know, depending on what you get. If it's a ring, if it's a necklace, if it's earrings. So if you want to get something a little bit more personal uh, for your loved one, then I would suggest getting them something to do with their birthstone. Next up, we have advent calendars. I recently got my first advent calendars. And, um... Well, first ones that are like filled with something. Uh, I did last year haul like an empty advent calendar that you fill in yourself, but these are actually filled with stuff. So the first one is a lint chocolate advent calendar. I actually got this from World Market and it has, I think, 25 days all 25 days for uh christmas and this is so fun i i never hear people talking about these kind of advent calendars i don't know why i think these are so fun like something little every single day leading up to christmas especially you have like little ones they would be so excited i'm sure because i'm i'm excited i'm excited to do this i can't even imagine how a little kid would feel the thing is it actually tells you what kind of chocolates there are so um like, like, for example, I don't like cherry-filled chocolates, so if I saw that on here, I wouldn't get it. <laughs> but thankfully, all of them look really delicious. I mean, and it's lint chocolate, so I love lint chocolate. And I will be opening each day on my Instagram. <laughs> I thought that would be fun, you know, because I'm going to open it anyways. I might as well share it with you guys. So we will open the advent calendar each day together. So make sure you're following me on my Instagram. So I did get another advent calendar. Um, if you have a Harry Potter lover, this one is it. Get them this. This has the 24 days leading up to Christmas, uh, 24 Funko Pops in here, like mini Funko Pops. I mean, how cute. Look at this. Oh my gosh, I can't. I actually got this from Amazon, and I also did see this at Box Lunch. So if you have a Harry Potter fan, then I would suggest getting them this because, oh my goodness, I just finished reading all of the Harry Potter books and watching all of the Harry Potter movies. I, I This was like my first time reading Harry Potter, so now I'm addicted. <laughs> and um, it's their 20 year anniversary or something as well which is like perfect. So yes, I love these. These would be so cute. Like after you open them, if, if you're you know an adult and you like to decorate, you can use them for tiered trays. And oh, I love this. I can't wait. And this also, I will be opening each and every day on my Instagram one day at a time. So um, yes, I will leave my Instagram information well, all over this video, I'm sure. So <laughs> uh, make sure you're following me on there. Next up, we have PJs. So I love getting pajamas. Is this like like a thing that happens when you get older? Because I don't remember being this excited for PJs, you know, when I was a kid. But I love getting new socks, new PJs, all of that. So this little set I actually got from Marshalls and it's $19.99. This actually comes with three pieces, okay? You have the little tank top and then you have the shorts right here and it comes with a little robe, a matching robe. Next up are my items from Sephora. I recently got some things 
from the VIB sale. Um, but I mean, just two things, which I didn't want to make a whole video out of. So I thought I would include it in this, but this would also be some great gift ideas. The first thing is this little drunk elephant set, I guess it comes with four of their items right here. And it, it actually comes in this egg. <laughs> this egg container, which is very interesting. I mean, could you imagine getting this as a gift? If you have someone that's like really into skincare and beauty and stuff like that, get them this. I have all of the uh, Drunk Elephant goodies. I think it comes with, let's see, the TLC from Bruce, from Boost Glycolic Night Serum, which is why I wanted this. Um, and then it also has the uh, Electrolyte Water Facial Mask Hydrant. Then the jelly cleanser and the proteiny polypeptide cream. Let's see what else I got in here. Oh, I did get some samples. Let me see. Okay, this is the Belief Aqua Balm Brightening Vitamin C Cream, in case you're wondering. The Kiehl's Clearly Corrective Dark, dark Spot Solution. I think this is like from my points or something I redeemed. The uh, other sample is the Algenist. Algoronic acid moisture veil. I don't I don't even know. In case you guys are interested, let's see. I'm trying to dig through, there's like a bunch of tissue and stuff like that here. Oh, I also got the Shiseido Urban Environment Oil Free UV Protector, Broad Spectrum SPF 42. And I got the Bio Biosense Squalene Lactic Acid Resurfacing Night Serum. And um, oh, the makeup eraser. Okay, so I have heard of this. This would make a great stocking stuffer. Uh, I heard like wonderful things about this. This is my first one, so I haven't tried it yet, but I will of course let you guys know my thoughts on this. But um, yeah, as a stocking stuffer, I think this would be great. What, what is this? Oh, peppermint oil. I don't know how this got in here. This is peppermint essential oil, which I got from Amazon. This is randomly in here. Where did my other... I found it. Okay, so the other item, the only other item that I bought from Sephora was the Virgin Marula Luxury Facial Oil. Uh, this stuff is so expensive, but I mean, we're heading into the winter months and my skin could definitely use some moisture. Moving on from Sephora, uh, let's see. Okay, so this is very, very, very small. This is like a little stocking stuffer, but it's also genius. <laughs> These are ring adjusters. So this is what it looks like. They're like little spirals and you just kind of thread it into the ring that you want to make tighter. Uh, I actually have one on. These are called like ring snuggies, I think, but some of, sometimes these slip off. So this is the only one I have left. They, they came in like a pack and um, this is the only one that I have left. So I thought I would give these a try. I haven't actually tried these yet, but they have amazing reviews on Amazon. I just think this is something that no one really thinks about, but it's always frustrating when you have a beautiful ring and you can't wear it because it just keeps slipping off your finger. Moving on, we have, oh, my planner. Oh my gosh, okay. So every year I get a new planner which I love. And every year I actually stick with a color theme, which is blush pink. This is this year's uh, planner. But this year I thought I would go with something a little bit different. And this is what I got. <laughs> yes, it is a Mickey Mouse planner. How exciting. Oh my goodness, this is actually from Walmart. And let's see, I think this was like $25 but they do have it online as well. I saw it online and I love that they have the tabs. The main thing that I look for is that they have this big calendar here because I like to see like all of the days like spread out so that I know what's coming up and everything. But I mean, it's so beautiful. I love the gold and the black and oh my gosh, it's, it's perfect. They also have like a weekly section, you know, so you can go into more detail for each day. And I love the binding of it because uh, sometimes when it's like spiral binding, it kind of like twists out and all the pages get ruined. So this one actually is completely closed and it's a little heart. Like how cute. 
That's such a nice detail. So if you have someone that is kind of into organization, keeping on top of things, if they are like a teacher or a nurse or something and they have to keep track of their shifts or whatever, get them a planner. But I would suggest giving them the planner along with these Frixion erasable pens. These are my favorite pens ever. And I mean, look at the, all the colors beautiful you can get like a like an array of colors but they also have like just black and just blue pens um these are from amazon and they are erasable i would love to have gotten this as a christmas gift like this would be great really excited about my new planner <sighs> something I look forward to every single year. Next would be another stocking stuffer. Uh, it's kind of random, but I recently did just get this and it is one of those little pimple patches. These would be great, especially if you have teenagers. Uh, this is by Real Beauty, I think. I think this had like the highest ratings, which is why I got it. Uh, I've only tried it like once or twice so far, so I, I haven't really formed an opinion yet, <laughs> but it does cover up the pimple. Like when you put on the sticker, it kind of, just masks the pimple a little bit and this pimple patch actually draws out the like pus or whatever is inside your pimples um, which is kind of gross but it needs to be done because so the pimple can heal faster uh, it says it's drug free non-drying and hypoallergenic so this would be so great to just add in a stocking you know something that you don't really think about but you know it does come in handy okay we're almost done the next item on my list is actually from Marshalls and this was $7.99 and these are Mickey Mouse slippers they're well slippers they're like in between slippers and socks because they have these little grippies on the bottom which is perfect especially if you have uh like older family members I would definitely suggest getting gripped socks and slippers for them for sure so uh yes i did get these this was in the checkout aisle that is where they get you i always find goodies in the checkout aisle <sighs> but this was mickey mouse and i was trying so hard not to get them i was i promise you i was but my husband was like are you kidding me it's mickey mouse you love mickey mouse you sure you don't want it and i was like yeah yeah I need it. It says it's for sizes 4 to 10, so most likely it'll be easy to um, fit any family members that you're planning on giving it to. This would be a great item to pair with pajamas, and these are so soft. And the last item on my list are chocolates. The first one is by Lint, again, Lindor Chocolate, and it is the milk chocolate. This is my husband's favorite. We actually got two bags of these, so... Um, those are amazing and then my favorite during the holiday season is by Ghirardelli it's their peppermint bark and they have the dark chocolate version and the milk chocolate version the milk chocolate is my favorite but they both taste really really good and I do not like anything mint or peppermint at all except at Christmas time and at Christmas time, I just, I have to have these. I, I just do. So I got these. But if you are gifting chocolate, might I suggest something more unique? Um, the, oh my gosh, this is from Lint too, man. This is not like exactly Christmas um, themed. So, uh, I mean, this would be great if, you know, they you're celebrating something other than Christmas. But this is like a little creation dessert assorted chocolate sampler and they have tiramisu uh eclair caramel meringue fondant chocolate creme brulee brownie and oh gosh what does that say milli filet something french i think i don't know bleu de la bleu de blue blah bleu. <laughs> i mean i've never seen this before i got this from world market and ugh, I, I don't see a price on here but i think it was like 12 to 15 bucks. Let me show you a close up. I mean, would this not be perfect for that person in your life that is obsessed with dessert and chocolates? That would be me. I am obsessed with desserts and chocolate. Alrighty guys, so that is it for my gift guide slash haul. I hope you guys enjoyed. Please subscribe if you haven't already. Give this video a big thumbs up and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.